Hey everybody, in today's video we're going to be taking a look at the health snapshot feature on the Garmin Forerunner 955 watch. Now I'm using the solar, shouldn't matter whether you've got the solar or the non-solar, this is a feature that's available on both of them. It's kind of a tricky feature to use because it's a little bit hidden in the watch and depending on how you do things, it's kind of hard to figure out where it is. First and foremost, this is a touchscreen watch. I'm going to be using the buttons today, but if you're a touchscreen person, you could obviously use the touchscreen functionality to do this as well. The reason I was saying it's tricky is there is a health snapshot glance that if you go to it first, you won't be able to see anything and it doesn't really guide you on how to get to the, the health snapshot. So the first thing I would recommend doing is adding the health snapshot in your applications and activity listing. The way we can do that is we can press the top right button that takes us to our apps and applications. I've already got it here. If you don't see it in yours, go to the bottom of the list. I just simply press the up button, but you could also go all the way down into your listing and you can get to the ad. You can also do this in the Garmin Connect app on your cell phone and you can add it there. It's already on the watch. You don't have to go to the Garmin Connect IQ app and download it. You just need to show it or make it visible in your applications and applica uh, application and activity listing. This is what it looks like. Basically what this is going to do is it's going to do a two minute test and it's going to measure some different metrics on us and give us an overall cardiovascular status. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to choose health snapshot. It's going to say press start to measure measures for up to two minutes. I'm going to start the activity. I'm going to let you get a look at what you can see on it and then maybe I'll speed it up so you don't have to sit there for two minutes and just watch my uh, metrics keep continuing. We're going to go ahead and press the start and stop button. It says sit comfortably and hold still and it starts counting down. Now normally I think you'd want to be quiet, you'd want to be still, you'd want to be doing some normal breathing while this is going on. You can see once it starts, it's using my pulse oximeter up here. It's basically measuring my uh, blood oxygen level. We can also see my stress level, my heart rate, my respiration rate, and then we've basically got a, count, a timer that will count us down for two minutes. I'm going to speed this part up. When we get done, I'll show you what happens afterwards, and then we'll take a look at the glance. Activity has completed. It's going to be kind of like any other activity. It's basically going to give us a summary. My average heart rate, my average SpO2, average respiration, average stress, and then my HRV status. I can press the top right button and I have two options. I can either save it or I can discard it. If you save it, it will be available to you in your health snapshot glance and we're going to go take a look at that here in a second. If you want to discard it, you could simply use the down button and go to discard. I'm going to go ahead and save this one. Now that it's saved, it basically puts me back in my main watch face. Now we can go to the glance. You don't have to. You could just say, hey, I'm done with my health snapshot. There's also a glance that you can go to. If we press the up or down button, again, if you're using touchscreen, you could swipe up or down. If we go down, one of the glance options you've got available to you is the health snapshot. Again, if you don't see it in your glance list, go to the very bottom. You can choose edit. It's on your watch. You just have to make it viewable. When we go to the health snapshot, it will show us the last time we took a health snapshot. For me, that was today at 1.57 p.m. If I press the start and stop button, it will take me in and show me my previous saved sessions of health snapshots. So you can see I had the one at 1.57 p.m. today. I could review that one. That's the one we just did. If I wanted to go back and look at a previous one, I can go back to any of the previous ones listed and I could pull them up as well. I think kind of the reasoning behind this is maybe if you're doing exercises or you started yoga and you want to see whether or not your health seems to be getting better, maybe you had COVID and you're tracking that kind of stuff, you can go look at a previous health snapshot and then you can compare it to a more recent one. Once you're done with your glance, you can simply press the back button a couple of times to get you back to your main watch face. Anyway, I hope that gives you an idea of at least what the health snapshot is. As always, I appreciate you watching. Have a good day.